boredom has kicked in today, so me and Gordy are out with the lure rod. Ow! Just got it. <laughs> Just out with the lures, just come out of change, put some bait in the lure pots, uh, in the lure pots, in the crab pots, and uh, thought we'd have a quick go for a couple of bass on the spinning gear. So, here we go, let's have a little fucking yahoo. See, it'll just been it, here you there you go. Fish on! <laughs> They go within seconds, and that actually feels like something half kind of decent. Feels like a bass. I hope it is a bass. I don't know. Probably a garfish, but. I think it's recording. I hope it's recording. No, I think it's, I think it's a garfish. Oh, just come off. <laughs> just come off right there. I don't know if you can see it in the water. Let's get that back out. We're in gear. Let's have another go. Oh, there's another garfish. We've got this way to splash it. There's something, there's something jumping behind it as well. for a bass but we'll keep going we'll keep going This one, little garfish. Little garfish. All we're using, a pile of lure, a bit of fluorocarbon. We just usually stick it out away from the boat and then start letting a bit of line out. Usually I like to get it so it's away from the wake. You see the wake of the propeller or the white water so it's past that and then I'll engage it. Make sure your ratchet's set really light. It's even a big bass when it hits you can just pull it straight away from it even if you've got trebles in, single works, two trebles keep it set really lightly so as soon as it hits it it's got it no matter what we'll do this a couple more times but by the looks of it all there is is lots of garfish here today so i trawl there you go fish on fish on fish on fish on fish on 
up a nice little fight. Pretty sure it's just another garfish. Down. We'll do this a couple more times and then I reckon we'll, we'll knock on the head because it's just loads and loads of garfish. Um, but it's still good fun, something to do, beats sitting at home. Get this back out and we'll see if we can get another one. When you're fishing for these garfish on the lure, sometimes they like to smack it, but not take it. So if they do do that, and you are trawling around like this, best sometimes is just to drop your rod back, let it go loose for a second, gives them a chance to just hit it properly. Uh, we'll see if um, we can get a couple more, and then we'll call it. Now, I was hoping for a couple of bass, to be honest. There's usually one or the other here, it's usually bass or garfish, one or the other, you don't usually get many of both. So, do a couple more trolls up and down through here and then we'll call it, go and check the crab pots and see if we've got any lobsters or anything in them. Lots of these lovely little lobsters about. Like I say, little being the key word. See you later. Yeah, so that was it, not much in them, but so if anyone's interested, which I know you will be asking, so it's the Rapala. Sorry, a bit sun glare, Rapala X trap lure. That's what we're using. Very good little lure, very good. Anyway guys, I'm gonna see you later on. Take it easy, bye.